All right, guys, welcome to part two uh, from registering the styles. And this is going to be video number four. We're going to be enqueuing the script. Uh, this is going to be a WordPress function. So let me just show you that WP enqueue script and W enqueue scripts. So I already added the helper code so I could just not waste your time. But let me just uh, tell you what this is. All right, so basically, you got a basic PHP function. And let me call that and go and go theme scripts for example. Then close that. And then afterwards we're gonna add the WordPress function add action, which in it we're gonna enqueue all the scripts that are gonna be added in the function itself, and then we're gonna enqueue we're gonna I'm sorry uh, add the action for the function itself which is gonna be Ango theme scripts so to register and enqueue the uh, script we're just gonna w enqueue script and for the styles it's just gonna be w enqueue style that's all you need to know for now all right and in it there's gonna be two things first off the name and the directory so to get the directory that we added in the assets folder over here we're just gonna get template directory we are URA and then add a dot to avoid any errors then put in the assets folder CSS and I'm sorry here we're gonna add the JavaScript and then just copy the name let me just open this up. Yep. And this is the directory right now. So, so again, this is the name, and this is the directory for the asset itself. So let me just remove this. All right. And then we're gonna add another function. That's going to be called and go theme styles. Another function. And here we're going to WP on Q, like I said before, the style. And we're going to add two things as well the uh, name, which is going to be for now the style.css. And let's add another one, which is going to be bootstrap.css and we could just copy this to get the template directory and just change this into CS, CSS and get this just bootstrap.css bootstrap.css and this is just going to be the style uh, CSS, which is going to be the core styles we added before. Style.css, and this is going to be bootstrap.css. And let me just, yeah, add the action. Again, it's going to be WP on Q scripts. And then the, to add the action for the function name, which is in here, it's going to be Ango theme styles all right right now we don't have anything but actually I think the styles worked if you want to check those out just go to more uh, go to Google Chrome more tools than developer tools go into sources then into your WP includes which is gonna be uh, showing you if your styles are rendered so the styles are rendered but the javascript is still not rendered uh, so let me just try a nav bar for example let's add that in the header just a simple nav bar where is it this the one that's on mobile this one the one that's on mobile yep so here's one added into the header. Well, let me just. Uh, all right. 
So yeah, it's working as you could see. The styles is working and the JavaScript is working since that the navbar when we press on it works. So basically this is how you register your JavaScript files to your WordPress team. Check out the next video where we're going to be creating the header dynamically which basically I'm going to create a page and then when I create a page it's going to be showing over here on the navbar. So thank you so much for watching this video. You guys comment, like and subscribe. Peace. This was Engo.